Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Ask Dr. Bob and once again we thank all for all of your questions and input that you're giving to us, Facebook, sending them on to your family and friends, it's been, it's been really tremendous. A lot of great questions. Dr. Bob, how to cleanse from taking an antibiotic and then developing candida? Probably the most important aspect is you want to re collimate your body with a very appropriate bacteria or acidophilus. I think it's really significant that you add that to your system and you want to make sure you're eliminating sugar and other yeast products. There are a variety of great products that you can get out in the marketplace. Find one that you feel comfortable with. I know if you go to our website we have one called BioDoff 7 one or two every day is tremendous. Dr. Bob, you previously mentioned a supplement to help your pet's digestion. Could you please revisit that subject? You know, we have a, uh, a pet, her name was Belle. Belle's a Maltese and she actually lived on the planet for 18 years and recently we had to put Belle down because she was just having some challenges. But along the way, we used a product called Maltezyme that's from a company called Standard Process and we gave her a half of a capsule of that every day and it helped her digestion and being a Maltese they tend to have red eyes depending on the size of your dog a digestive enzyme will help a lot of tearing a lot of eye and even skin irritation another thought is flax powder will help your pets with itchy skin Dr. Bob, with the holiday quickly approaching, how would you suggest eliminating unnecessary stress? It's kind of interesting you brought that up because I just had a practice member who just left and I said to her, you would be wise to say this, I can't say yes. What does that mean? Let's say somebody wants you to make 14 dozen cookies and you know you don't have the time or the energy to do it. Instead of saying no, a more appropriate, nice, very diplomatic would say, way to say would say, I can't say yes. And they're going to go, did you say no? That's a nice polite way of saying no. Because we, you know, we are asked so many times and for you out there right now that are asking people to do all this for you, you know, stop it. Let them have a great holiday time. So get to bed early. That is so significant. Getting to bed early, regular exercise. And I just had someone tell me today, Getting off sugar has done so much for her stress level because sugar takes uh, minerals out of the body, stress. I get itchy skin irritations during the winter time. Is there a natural leaf for this? Well, I also just mentioned to somebody else, these are great questions today, about getting maybe a shower dechlorinator because see, during the colder season, they tend to put more chlorine in the municipal water. So our shower dechlorinators take the chlorine out and chlorine can cause itchy skin lack of calcium can cause an itchy skin because you don't have as much vitamin D this time of the year. Consider some flax oil or a optimal EFA because flax oil and optimal EFAs help your body take calcium to tissue. So calcium lactate or calcium citrate, citrate would be very important. Drink water, shower dechlorinator, consider adding some vitamin D as in delta also helps calcium be absorbed. Oftentimes this time of year people are so much stressed they have weak adrenal glands and when they have weak adrenal glands they also can have stress and itchy skin. Dr. Bob, my elderly mother has developed hard lumps around her hand joints. Is this normal or can it be treated naturally? Great question. We had some conversation with a representative from one of the companies that we work with today there's a product that we have used called niacinamide. Niacinamide is a form of B vitamins that helps osteoarthritis challenges, but avoid dairy products, avoid sugar products. Sugar and dairy, you'd be amazed how those joint pain will relieve almost immediately, but I'll, I'll, I'll end with this thought. The liver, if it's compromised, will cause stiff joints. Get rid of the dairy, try some nice cinnamide, 250 milligrams a day, it'll be great. Thank you for joining me, pass this information on, you have a great day.